Okay, Tyler. We're gonna rescue the president. Sure we are. Don't forget to find your guide to rockets. That's where I came from. Okay. All right. You find any more awesome uh, puns there? Uh, yeah. I forgot since we didn't do one when we saved. I have to fill in. Oh, 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 dickhead. Um. Okay, this one's really good. Here, this is on the lighter side. Alright. Are you ready? The nature of life is such that if you tell your boss that you were late for work because your car broke down, the next day your car will break down! Ah! Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 like, that's not even like so bad, it's funny, it's just bad. That's, like, just, that's not a joke. That's just. That's nothing. Cameras um, in here. Oh, let's, let's chafe them. You got I don't know. Like, comment, subscribe uh -huh. if you're. Oh, Nikita. That's what I'm looking for. The actual Nikita itself. Like, comment, subscribe if you're an old person and you find that funny. Old people don't watch YouTube. They might. Alright, buddy. You don't watch YouTube. <laughs> Come on, buddy. There you go. That's a dog. He's, he he wants to know what's going to happen next. Yes. He's like, we'll ride and rescue the president in time. Alright, what the fuck am I doing here? Oh yeah, I need to go to the other floor. Yeah, Oh. Alright. Come on, elevator. Come on, come on. Come on. Turn around. <laughs> Turn around. So I got how that's kind of flirtation chamber. <laughs> like that's a, my favorite kind of chamber. It's just the bar. Maybe if I opened right. up a nightclub, that's what that's what I would call it, the flirtation chamber. <laughs> it's not a bad name. Yeah, I'm down with it. Be all like straight and to the point. Oh, that's right. What? I get to swim. Oh. Boy, do I not like the swimming in this game. Kind of busy swimming here. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> oh, what am I doing? B1 is completely flooded from what I can see. You'll have to swim to find swimming. Oh, yeah, I guess we've established the, the, the magic nano machines lets them just swim faster. communicate right. anyway. Change your heading right. with the left stick. The, the, up will take you up, down takes you lower, left and right to face those directions. <laughs> Thanks. The O2 gauge. Couldn't have figured that out yeah, on my own. Yeah, you know own. what? We're fine. <laughs> yeah. I usually listen to the uh, codec conversations, but we're fine. We don't need. We don't need. Okay. Oh, Actually, maybe I did need to listen because holy shit! It goes in the direction you tell it. Up, make it go I high. know it keeps switching on me. God damn it! You go down first, and or like okay, left. Now down. It's not going oh. the direction of pressing. So oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Off to a great start. Yay! All right. Ah. Let's get some, some air. And hmm. I know that Nikita's down here somewhere. I just forget where. Hey, how you doing, lady? My lady. My lady. Tip the hood. Um. Uh. <sighs> Men's rights solid. <laughs> Oh god, there's a landmine there. Or an underwater mine. Uh, there's another one! Or whatever, no, that was... Uh, That's a... That's a Nikita. There was like an action figure or something floating there. Oh. Okay. You have the remote controlled missile. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, it's, it's that guy! Oh, uh... It's Vulcan again. Eh, nice. I guess I should uh, go get some air. You're dying! It's alright. It's alright. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I don't think you insta die. I think your hey, life, yeah, your your life health, starts ticking yeah. down, yeah. Where? 
All right, we're fine. Everything's fine. Yeah. Everything's Swing good. Love over. One stop thought from hell. Yeah. Uh oh. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> Shimmy steps. Uh, I love it. Okay. Now I got my Nikita. Now we can save and or kill the president. Do, 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 do. My Nikita. You know what? I'm going to try it your way first. I'm going to try to just kill the president. Let's try it. <laughs> you get like an alternate ending. That'd be fantastic. I know that's not how the game wants you to do it, but logically for me, like, if they're worried about the codes and they said, like, you have to keep the president alive. The bad guy keeps saying you have to keep the president alive. Maybe you should just kill the president. Make that decision for him. You wouldn't even see it coming. Fair point. Of course I have a point. I'm a voice of a generation. Unfortunately, that generation hasn't been born yet, but... Alright. When it does... Let's go! Good thing it has all these convenient ramps. I know, right? It's great. Wee! Hey, hey, Mr. President. What is hey. What is hey. that? Yeah, how you doing? <laughs> ah! <laughs> what the hell happened? Right. Right in. Aww. I'm that's sorry. Still, that's still a success in my books. So I don't know. Nuclear crisis averted. In Metal Gear Solid 3, there's a chance to kill like someone who's a character in like these games. And oh, if you yeah? do it, it's a game over, and it's like, you've created a time paradox! <laughs> oh. Alright, let's try this for realsies, I guess. I guess. I'm assuming that person is off a lot. I mean, so far, I'm like, oh. oh! Oh god. Nothing to see here. I think that was just the president. There are guards. Oh. There's no one coming. I think I'm fine. I think so. Dirty ass Raiden. <laughs> Whoops. Oh. Stop taking those quarters so sharp. I'm trying to get the best times though on my time trial. <laughs> and I guess you do have limited fuel. Fred. Yeah, you do. I think I just went the wrong way, yep, so... Yeah, you overshot it. Do 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 Was it here? No. Um, there? Yeah, yeah there, there we go. go. Hey, President. No, stop it. Like, move away, Mr. What is President. Get away! No, just stop it. There we go. <laughs> I was worried he was going to get caught in the explosion yeah. there. But I guess not. Alright, I did it! Yay! Now I can go all across the electrified floor! Boop boop! You're not Obama! <laughs> President Johnson! Huh? So you're finally here. You've been expecting me? Your equipment, that skull suit, isn't exactly standard military. Oh, you candidate? <laughs> Hmm. Are you all right, sir? Is this some kind of sick joke? I thought yes. you came to kill me. <laughs> yeah, I did. That's what Tyler wanted. Yep, sure I'm is. prepared to face the consequences of my betrayal. What are you... Oh. Really? What the... He did try to grab your dick. A man? Hmm. <laughs> he did well, try to grab your dick. Foxhound, okay. sir. Okay. Foxhound? <laughs> that made no sense. I see. Now things are starting to make a little sense. <laughs> if you say so. Switch over to nano communication so nobody can listen in. Yes. And so they don't have to animate anymore this scene. Yeah. Do you read me, sir? Uh, yes. Not a chance. Mr. President, <laughs> it's my understanding that the terrorists have managed to input the code sequence necessary for launching a nuclear strike. That's correct. I punched the sequence in myself. You're working You're for them? If you asked gets. me two hours ago, my <laughs> answer would have been yes. Right now, they're keeping me alive until my vital signs are reconfirmed. They betrayed you? I wouldn't quite put it that way. I wanted power. They sought destruction. But why stoop to terrorism? I wanted absolute power. 
But you're the president. You have power. That's an absolute. I'm mm. just a figurehead. What? Mm. I don't have any control. The real power is in the Patriots' hands. The Patriots? The truth behind this country. I'm not surprised you've never heard of it. Illuminati time! <laughs> Even among those with code word clearance. Politics, the military, the economy, they control it all. They even choose who I like the music got a Lex Spy movie. Put it yeah. Simply, <laughs> the Patriots rule this country. No. Hmm. Hard to believe, isn't it? But it's the truth. The space defense, income tax reduction, and national missile defense programs. Every policy that's been credited to me was actually done according to their instructions. Space defense was initiated by Congress. That's what the Patriots want the country to believe. Illuminati, it's Illuminati. <laughs> Democracy is just a filler for textbooks. <laughs> Think about it. Do you actually believe that public opinion influences the government? I believe Bush was actually president when this, this game came out. This is shaped and yeah. controlled as the Patriots see fit. The people are shown what they want to believe. I was going to say uh, solid is a well seems like a combination between Clinton and Bush. The public. <laughs> huh? Don't look at me like that. I'm legally sane, you know. It's not your sanity <laughs> that worries me. It's your breath. Have a tic tac. The Patriots. Even I don't know who the actual members are. Are they financial, political, or military leaders? No one knows who the Patriots really are. Even my instructions come from a cutout. All I've been told is that every key decision is made by a group of 12 men known as the Wise Men's Committee. Your office? The White House? Merely puppets. Pawns in a game. By pledging my loyalty, an insignificant son of a senator hey, was awarded two the Obama. presidency. <laughs> <laughs> of course, that wasn't the only price I had to pay. What do you mean? Even if a pawn becomes a queen, it is still just a playing piece. I wanted to leave my own mark in history. But my ambitions were... You'll understand someday. No, tell me now! <laughs> I want to know now! Now, I now, now! I wanted to be a member now. of the Patriots. I wanted to wield the power of a king instead of being an expendable pawn. And that justifies acts of terrorism? Yes. yes. <laughs> I'd intended to use the new Metal Gear as a bargaining chip. Bargaining chip? But I underestimated Solidus. He actually wants to challenge the Patriots, even if it means the destruction of the world. What are you saying? Whether you believe it or not, the balance of power rests in the hands of the Patriots. They regulate the country's various interests through controlled presentation, staging a drama that is palatable to the general masses. Can you imagine what would happen if they ceased to function? Picture a massive political vacuum. A space that every power monger will try to fill for their own greedy ends. I'm talking about an unregulated power struggle. Panic, civil war, chaos. Sounds fun. Like it or not. Sounds like a good setting for video game. an organization that must continue to exist. So you changed your mind Except because you wanted they to avoid could use the fake chaos. structures that are in place and <laughs> treat them as if they were when real. I told Solidus that I wish to prevent disaster. He replied that like, pawns stop with your logic. <laughs> and who is this Solidus? Former president, duh. my predecessor, George Sears. That was the name the public came to know him by. I knew him by his code name, Solidus Snake. He was the third snake, preceded by Solid and Liquid, a survivor of the Les Enfants Terribles project. Neither Solid nor Liquid. He was a well-balanced masterpiece that the Patriots saw fit to entrust with the presidency. However, he fell out of grace with the organization four years ago. When acting on his own, he started an incident. Four years ago? Shadow Moses! That's right. At the time, the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, together with certain influential parties, initiated the yeah, old, old graphics. Rex yeah. and an advanced nuclear warhead. However, this did not fall in line with the Patriots' plans. What's more, Solidus decided on his own to send his most trusted man, Ocelot, to provoke Liquid Snake, bringing about the said incident. 
As a result, he succeeded in obtaining Rex and the data on the warhead. But in doing so, he ended up revealing the existence of both Rex and the Genome Army, a blunder that earned him the wrath of the Patriots. Shortly thereafter, Solidus was removed from the presidential office. I thought he resigned. That's the story given to the general public. Following his Come resignation, the Patriots <laughs> selected me, their new pawn. Ben's not the, the smartest guy, okay? But that would no. mean that the presidential race was... That was quite a show, wasn't it? It was a well-scripted drama staged by the Patriots for the benefit of the public. Even the Democrats and Republicans were dancing to the Patriots' tune. Everything went according to plan, but for one exception. Huh. Following his resignation, Solidus' health was scheduled to fail him bringing about his untimely death. Capped? Correct. But before the Patriots could In his execute ass. their plot, Meh. Solidus went underground with the help of Ocelot. As he avoided pursuit, Solidus gained control of Dead Cell, winning over Colonel Golukovich's outfit. From there, he bided his time, knowing that his opportunity would soon arrive. What opportunity? The completion of the new Metal Gear project, an opportunity that would even his odds against the Patriots. By stealing the Patriots' most valued Definitely project, not. he would be able to place them in a very uncomfortable position. Yeah. It's the only chance he has for survival. Once he has the new Metal Gear, he'll declare war against the Patriots. Needless to say, he must be stopped. Metal Gear is already operational. No, not yet. Hmm? What you saw was Metal Gear Ray. Hijacked yes. two years ago from the Marines <laughs> by Ocelot. I knew that. that was not the new Metal Gear. Then where's da, da, the new da, da, Metal Gear? Right here. Da, da. You're standing in it. To be more precise, this entire big shell facility is the new Whoa. Metal Gear. What you say? No, I'm quite serious. The upper structure that you've seen is camouflage, designed to represent an camouflage. offshore cleanup facility. The main structure extends from the foundation all the way down to the ocean floor. The connecting elevator is located on the B2 floor of the Shell 1 core. Arsenal Gear. That's the code name for the new Metal Gear. Arsenal? The plot thickens. That's right. Arsenal. We're talking about an impregnable fortress carrying a load of over a couple of thousand missiles, including nuclear warheads, all protected by a horde of mass-produced Metal Gear Ray units. Mass-produced? Yeah. The Ray unit was originally designed for the <laughs> I do like it. Like, first game, you fought one of these mechs. The second game, oh, there's an army of them, and it's on a big tank. The Patriots yeah. <laughs> had Ray redesigned to protect the new Arsenal gear. So now anti-metal gears are guarding a metal gear. Ironic, isn't it? That's not all. Arsenal like gear rain on your wedding access day. to the military's <laughs> tactical <laughs> network, giving it the ability to exercise absolute control over our nation's armed forces, not to mention our nuclear armament. In short, Arsenal was created to be the core of our country. What kind of idiotic weapon? Weapon? No. You're not seeing the full picture. <laughs> Arsenal gear is more than just a military tool. It is a means to preserve the world as it is. It will establish a new form of control. It also has the a Disneyland. Patriots will use it to keep their place as the country's <laughs> true rulers. Right now, they feel pressured and threatened. By what? They fear but. an overabundance of digital information. The world will drown in the coming flood of information, and they along with it. Hmm. The Arsenal plans include a system to digitally manage the flow of information, <laughs> making it possible to shape the truth for their own purposes. In short, the Arsenal system is the key to their supremacy. The key? Yes. The GW system is the Patriots' trump card. Arsenal gear will be fully operational when GW is successfully integrated. George W. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is named it will after. Be a completely new form of power <laughs> for the Patriots to wield. I had hoped to seize the project from them so that I would be in a strong bargaining position. Bargain for what? I'd hoped to trade my way into their ranks. Yes, he already explained that to you like five minutes ago. <laughs> Outer Heaven. His plan to unleash a nuclear blast over the skies of Wall Street to break the Patriots' control over the business community is also a key factor in his offensive effort. Outer Heaven? Listen, 
There isn't much time. The football served as the key for activating arsenal gear. I've already input the necessary code sequence. It won't be long before GW begins to establish connections with other external systems, and arsenal gear becomes fully operational. Stop them before they have to be you can't that is your role. <laughs> Roll. George You've got Bush. To find Emma Emmerich. She's the only one who can stop Emma that thing Emmerich. once it's been M -M Emma Emmerich? She's the system programmer for Arsenal Gear. What? Level B1 in the core Whoa. of this I thought the levels below us were flooded. I'm sure they won't let her die just yet, as she's the only remaining programmer for this project. According to Ocelot, she was being held in a locker room located in the northwest Whoa. part of level B1. Cut transmission and get moving. Did you get all that? This is I did. Four. Did you? It'll give you yep. access all the way to Emma's location. I was asking the audience. Give this tour when you find her. If not, yes. just rewind the video. For disrupting the yes. control functions between GW and Arsenal Gear. Take Emma to the computer room on level B2, Shell 1 core. She'll know how to load the program into the main system. A virus? I want That's a right. Team right. Emma. After Fox die. A or it'd be called Team M&M. And M <laughs> and be Emma Frost and Emma Franklin. Yeah, sure. You have it. I like those two things. Yeah. And Ocelot Even though one's a fictional character? You've got to hurry. They're both technically the fictional characters. You're, you're a fictional character. That's right. Well, I've told you everything you need to know. Who made me? There's only one thing that remains to be done. Huh. Sip. Suck on it. Now, kill me. What? I called it. <laughs> There's no time to argue. The final check for my vital ID will start any second. If you kill me now, you'll at least prevent the nuclear strike. Cut it out! Come on, Raiden, don't be an idiot! <laughs> That's your role! Kill him. That's abusing your right to free speech, Mr. President. Or is it ex-president? The president! Why did you... Alas, my finger must have slipped. <laughs> I'll see you around, carrier boy. Oh, Forget once again, <laughs> someone is Without Fox Die. Him, there is no difference between submission and rebellion. My only real choice is to put an end to this charade. Let me at least have the freedom. It's a jackal. A jackal. To end Is it a jackal? Myself. What are you? Find Emma. Stop Arsenal. <laughs> this is my last order as your commander in chief. I'm counting on you. Blip. <sighs> Blip. I want like little cartoon actors to be over his eyes. <laughs> All right, so oh. we saved the president. Yay! Yay! Exposition dump. Exposition dump. Exposition, exposition, exposition. I like it. Yeah. Exposition. It makes me know what's yeah. happening. Yeah, me too. It's like the stuff is going on. <laughs> yeah. With the people, the president, and the things. I see. And the GW. Sorry to hear that. Where do we go from here? No, you're Your not. mission was to rescue the president and eliminate the terrorist threat. He However, fucked one of those up, so... Defense, we will well, the president's you can just switch threat. those around so you, you must he eliminated the president, the president now has to around. rescue the terrorist threat. Do you actually hmm. think there's any truth Sounds to this like a plan. story about yeah. this big shell facility being a front for arsenal gear? I don't have the security clearance necessary to verify <laughs> the facts. However, <laughs> he was the president. I'm sure he knew what he was talking about. Aren't you forgetting that he was part of the terrorist plot? All the more reason why I believe his information is reliable. That makes sense. We're talking about a man who chose to die rather than risk a nuclear holocaust. Thanks to his sacrifice, the Nuclear Launch Authority has shifted to the Vice President, effectively eliminating the terrorist threat. Colonel, when you put it like that, 
It almost sounds like I should have assassinated the president to exactly. eliminate the threat. Oh, who said that? Yeah, Tyler, you're smart. To point out that there is certainly some credibility to the words of a man dumb. who chose death <laughs> to protect the innocent. No. The colonel has yes. a point, Jack. What about the information he gave me on the Patriots? That's a new one on me. I'll see what I can find out. I guess, like, getting the information. Right. We're the running out of time. Find but... Emma. I suppose. She's supposed to be located on level B. I'm assuming Oslo's the core of that building the Patriots. Patriots. Right? You've got um, to find her before Arsenal becomes fully operational. Solid. Hurry, Jack. It's, just... it's up to you to make no. sure and that the president didn't sacrifice his life in pain. And when I'm back on the tanker, Ocelot did say he was here to take the Metal Gear back for the Patriots. Riding out. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, cause all these things have been referenced already. What's your status, Ryden? Snake, the president, he's been assassinated. What? By me. There's nothing I could do. What about the nuclear strike code sequence? He died before his vital ID could be reconfirmed. Then the enemies lost their nuclear strike capability. But that Ocelot guy obviously killed the president on purpose. Why? It doesn't make any sense. They had to know that they couldn't launch the nuke if they killed the president. Maybe there's a way to launch without reconfirming the vital ID. Or maybe they found a more effective weapon within Arsenal gear. You knew about Arsenal gear? <laughs> yeah. Mm. Why didn't you tell me about it? You never asked. Am I correct <laughs> in assuming you also know that How the big shell is a front for the it. project? You mean, did I know that the big shell, a fully functional environmental cleanup facility, was designed to camouflage Arsenal gear? Yeah, I did. It's exactly what the president and Ames described, a massive cover story. The good news is that it hasn't really done much in terms of cleaning up the environment. What? So we won't have to worry about any toxic gas being released if we have to blow the house down. <laughs> okay. Right. And when did you find out about all of this? Oh, because it's already while, there. But yeah, we uncovered okay. the info around the time you took out that mad bomber. There's no doubt that Arsenal Gear oh, has Ryan. been built here. Then it you was know nothing. Two years ago, yeah. on that day, all of it. Two years ago, what really happened here? I took these photos two years ago. I know these pictures. They were on the news on several websites. If I remember right, the reporters blamed you for sinking the tanker. You can tell it's not the picture that's I actually took because it was taken from the top me. level. Yeah. <laughs> We'd hoped that by going public with photos of the new Metal Gear, we could persuade the government. At least that was the plan at the time. I've gone through VR training of the tanker mission before. Yeah? Well, I doubt it accurately simulates the events of that mission. I'd infiltrated the dummy tanker to obtain proof that a Metal Gear was under development. Shortly after I made it aboard, an armed group led by Colonel Gerlukovich raided the ship and gained control. Olga and Ocelot were among the raiding... Yeah, remember I said when they made the tank piece in this chapter? Yeah. As if yeah, you could play it without doing the tanker chapter? Supposed to be yeah. Dead. Yeah, so they're recapping it right here. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, yeah. right. Yeah. But Ocelot eliminated Colonel Gerlukovich and Marine Commander Scott Dolph, and he hijacked Ray. So we betrayed them? I don't know what kind of deal was going down. All I remember is what Ocelot said at the time. Something like, I'm taking it back. Ocelot then sank the tanker along with the soldiers of the Marine Corps. Yeah, it sucked to be them. Yep. They're Marines, you think they're gonna have to swim. Yeah, Autocon Jeez. managed to have a small boat ready for me. That was the easy part. The tough part was There's supposed to be a sequence where I escaped the tanker, but they cut that for time. About it. <laughs> it turned out that the whole thing was a setup to lure us. Photos of Snake, taken by the Cypher, were released to the public. In turn, we became the world's most wanted environmental terrorists. It was definitely a move aimed at putting a stop to sure, our anti Metal Captain Gear Pirate. activities. Yeah, but why did they choose like, Snake? snake. <laughs> Since the Shadow Moses incident, Snake became sort of a hero. It's like one of those misunderstanding things. It was like, you sank that oil tank, Snake. Yeah. I'm going to stop you. About the and then they fight, but then they like make up. They yes, team up against a the real villain who's like, I don't know. Like everyone knows about them except Sludge me. Sludge Snake. They didn't Snake. choose Snake yeah. to be a hero, so they decided to do a smear campaign. It's the fourth clone. I think yeah. the Patriots wanted to make an His uh, DNA was so mixed with like oil. Before opposing yep. them. Huh. That's it! They set all this up just to nail you guys! No, there's more to it than that. The Marines Metal Gear Ray project, headed by Commander Dolph, was carried out in opposition to the Navy's Arsenal Gear project. 
To be more precise, the Patriots considered Metal Gear Ray to be a thorn in their side. Hence, they attacked the dummy tanker and stole Ray. They followed this up with a perfect plan. They immediately sent a fully loaded tanker to the same location and sank it, then set up the facility to camouflage the development of Arsenal Gear. And we fell for it. Two more puppets in their show. Waka waka waka. Mm. Colonel Grilukovich and his daughter Olga? Both fell victim to Ocelot's plot. Was Solidus behind all this? He used Ocelot to get hold of Ray, huh? No. He was underground, keeping a low profile at the time. Then it must be the Patriots. If that's the case, what's Ocelot doing alongside Solidus? Manipulating him. Of, co of course! Don't you know anything about politics? Forget it. Uh, We're wasting time. time. We can figure this out later. <laughs> yeah. The nuclear strike's been prevented, but Arsenal still has a massive payload of missiles to deal with. Right. If the opposition gets control of those missiles... Raiden, you've got to find Emma. Wait a second. Isn't Emma Emrek My sister. What's she doing here? You got me. She's a computer whiz who specializes in neural AI and ultra-variable volume data analysis hey, using complex <laughs> logic. How she got involved in weapons development is beyond Get me. Real. Hmm. Get real. Get real, We need her in order if to If I saw Otacon in real life, I'd Raiden, give him a find her. I'm on my way. <laughs> I'd like leave him hanging from a tree or something. Aww. Poor Otacon. Alright. Now I think we might be done the exposition. Yay! Back to game. That was a lot of exposition. I feel sleepy now. <laughs> uh... But things taking a bit of an interesting turn. Yep. Illuminati shit and all that. Basically, yeah, so they mentioned who the Patriot. That, or that the Patriots was a thing, or like way, like in the, in the prologue, and now they just kind of confirmed what they are, and it seems to me like it's so obvious. Yeah, Otacon is working for them, and he's manipulating Solidus. You mean Ocelot? Yeah. What did I say? Otacon. <laughs> oh yeah. Imagine, evil, evil Otacon. Yeah. But I mean, you probably get to kill him eventually. That'd be great. Be pretty cool. I'd be down for that. And instead of like in in like his boss fight, instead of like trying to shoot you, he's like, love can bloom on the battlefield, and like he gives you like a box of chocolates. And he's like, fuck you, Otacon. You punch him in the mouth. And this is a good idea. He cries. And I laugh while he cries. Hey babe. Um oh. mines. Oh death charges us. Uh, probably get some air. <laughs> what do uh, you want? Leave me alone! Raiden, are you reading me? This is Otacon. What's your situation? Wet and miserable. This place is flooded. The oh, seawater that's been pumped up is pouring into the yeah, building. Yeah, because that bomb blew up. Mm. Listen, there's something I have to tell you about EE. E. Don't worry about her. I'll get her out. She's afraid of water. What? Yeah. <laughs> When she was six years old, she almost drowned with my father in our swimming pool. She can't swim? Well, yes and no. We used to swim a lot together when we were kids. Get real. In fact, she swam like a fish until that day when she almost drowned. When the accident happened, I was in my room. <laughs> I learned later that E.E. E. was calling me for Get help. Uh -huh. She didn't doubt for a minute that I'd be there. You suck, Otacon. You could see the pool from my room, but I didn't realize at the time that she needed my help. What were you doing? I... I was... So Emma survived the ordeal? Yeah, but my father didn't. So you blamed yourself and left your family? No. E.E. E. seems to believe that was the case. The fact is, I betrayed her. And you think she can't swim because of the traumatic experience? I haven't seen her since that day, but yes, I think so. I got a letter from Julie, her mother, after they moved back to England. In her letter, she mentioned that E.E. E. couldn't swim anymore. That she refused to even wear a bathing suit. Damn! If she still can't swim, damn! In I trouble. can't see her in a bathing suit. Yeah. One in the core is pretty much flooded. Look, maybe you can help her overcome the trauma. All right. You want me to help her get over it? Well, it's still gonna take some time to repair the cam off. Sorry, kid. Emma's rescue is up to you. Thanks. An underwater mission. <laughs> well, this is a first. Look, 
I'll see what I can do. Not I suggest first. that you drum the map of the building into your head, because you won't have time to look at it when you try to bring Emma out. I'm counting on you, Raiden. I covered most of the core when I had to take out the C4s. If there's anything you need to ask me, call me on the codec. I'll do that. All right, so I get to do an underwater escort mission. Yay! Two of the best things combined. I know, right? Fake. Also, Snake, you don't say C4s. It's just like you don't say Chineses. <laughs> uh. Drop a fender. Uh oh. Wee. Hello, hey Stillman. Oh, peg like feet. So, <laughs> ew, your blood's on me. Gross. There's gonna be sharks in there now, right? Because of blood. Eventually, I can see that being a thing. Have to like punch a shark. Yeah. You totally Fight get to punch shark. a shark in Arkham City. It's pretty great. <laughs> Fantastic. Luckily I know my way around this water area, so oh, it's not too bad. Good. I've played this game so many times. Yeah. Like, it's been years, but I've played it so many times. Yeah. I'm sure I've played through it at least ten times. Works good. I, I know this better than any of the Metal Gears. This is <laughs> the one i played the most. Yeah, it seems like it's really good. What's up, Vampire Man? He's sitting Still in the water. Ticking, huh? Hey, dude. Unfortunately, dude. hell had no vacancies. <laughs> That's a cool line. Oh, Phil Lamar. You're so dirty. Oh, right. I <laughs> ah! You made me bleed my own blood. Alright, fuck yeah. you. Human muscles are quite yeah. eloquent. They speak out clearly what a person's next move would be. They even tell me which way a gun is going to be pointed before the trigger is pulled. But your muscles, they're different. Okay, now I think they you're Mar in that. Yeah, oh yeah. Never worth the wait. Quite the tongue. Yeah, fuck. I bet the ladies love him. There's a there's a point where Big becomes too much. <laughs> the girl is just ahead. She is of no use to us now. But she served as well as the live bait for the big catch. Crazy Ivan sometimes speaks the truth. What? Emma's alive? She was some time ago. But the flooding has become quite serious. I wouldn't be surprised if she's a mermaid now. What? Did you really think killing the president would prevent a nuclear strike? Think again. I didn't do it. <laughs> Arsenal is still armed with a purified hydrogen bomb. Purified hydrogen bomb? This is no ordinary nuclear bomb. This weapon is capable of heavy hydrogen nuclear fusion using lasers and magnetics to generate heat insulated compression. I don't understand a word of that. Top secret project initiated by the current. They're just trying to use like base and science words. No <laughs> sound fans. <laughs> <please. laughs> the clean magnets, lasers. Those are cool. Fucking magnets. How do they work? It becomes launch capable. Man, imagine if the insane clown posse were the real villains. A nuclear threat still exists. This game super easy then. You just punch them. Like, Shut months. up. We Sit down! But they have the Juggalo army with them. We were then he smacks them in the face! He'd say, SHUT UP AND we SIT DOWN! Were <laughs> and they'd be like, the OH, YOU MADE ME! Civilians, as well as our own allies. And the public <sighs> believed every word, turning a dead ear to whatever clown. we had to say <laughs> to the contrary. Our only goal is to wipe them from the face of I had a friend who just like fucking loved those guys. Yeah, me too. And they were like religious about it. I'm like, I'm listening to this music, I'm like, 
We nope. might be the only ones to No, nope. don't see it. <laughs> it's crap. I don't care. Sign in the membrane. That that was someone else. That was Cypress Hill. <laughs> yes. Final check for activating Arsenal has been completed. I couldn't remember the name. Well, it sounds like Arsenal's ready to go into operation. Damn it! You're still hoping that the girl can install that virus you're carrying around, aren't you? Oh, he gave me a hint that he didn't have. Oh, maybe Raiden knew, but we didn't know. It's a shame you're not going to be around long enough to hand her the program. That I mean, he was talking about computer virus. It's a bio oh. of the microbes contained in the pool. Buoyancy is practically non-existent thanks to the high oxygen content. Once you walk in, you don't come up. Take a good look at your grave. Show me what you've got. Zip. <laughs> Rose. Rose. <laughs> Jack, da, 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 da. Yeah, late nineties techno rave. Everyone, get out your glow stick. Turn the light. Need file. Yeah, sure. Why not? I probably why? should have been doing all the files. Oh, why? Why is that? <laughs> yeah, just in case. Backups. Uh, okay, well, I think uh, next episode we're gonna fight Vamp. Wait, Rose didn't give us any advice. I Is better. It... Uh, hold on. Oh. We need some parting words here. Um. Oh, here we go. Here's a great one. Hey, wait. What must one do to have beautiful hands? Uh, jerk off a lot. Nothing. Oh, uh, I get it. <laughs> I, I, I want to die. <laughs> <laughs>